Standing on the top of the world changes one's perspective. Last night before I went to sleep, I made a wish to be able to reach farther and work harder. And my dreams tried to grant my wish. They took me out of the pain and struggle of trying to make money multiply and let me see the world from beyond the sky. Standing on top of the world makes me wonder what powerful force is in time and distance. For instance, it shrinks all my problems beneath my feet. Even a war looks like nothing more than a cloud of smoke from a few miles up. And even a king is just dust when his time is up. When you see all there is, you have to wonder. Maybe we were meant to explore the universe, to leave Earth for the animals. If so, I want to make a home among the angels in space. To hop between meteors, mining metals for as long as it takes to build a MacBook I can plug into the stars. My soul is no stranger to the outer reaches of heaven. It makes the journey there and back every time I offer prayers to God. But my eyes aren't accustomed to the sight and can barely comprehend the meaning of the power that such great distances speak. Distance makes a small soul a monster. That's why when I stand three feet away from a bum, it's far enough to ignore his pain and keep my blessings pocketed. I have to learn to extend my soul to the extent of my vision, so that if I'm ever standing at the top of the world, I can feel like a king and not just a critic. So that when I apprehend the fact of the entire universe with my eyes, from the space beyond the sky, I'm somehow able to love every living, shrunk down soul. But I guess that a bum is a good place to start. If I can find a way from him to my heart, that's a distance more difficult to travel than a thousand galaxies. It's love transcending the space-time continuum. Maybe Jesus was an astronaut. Maybe one day I'll be able to see the big picture without neglecting the small things in between. If I ever get to stand on the top of the world with my own two feet, maybe I'll see a way to connect every dot back to myself.